Hey YouTube, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Happy New Year's! Okay, so this is going to be my first review of 2019. It's going to be Side Chicks of Charlotte, the New Year's episode. So the episode saw us off with Brinks, you know, this little white chick, and her, her breast, talking about her breast implants. And then she goes to the little doctor to get a consultation on her augmentation. And she wanted porn, she didn't want the porn stripper um, breast. I mean, not porn stripper. What the fuck is that? <laughs> porn star breast. And the one she did show that would be porn star was like itty bitty. Because you know she flat chested. And the doctor was like, no, that's way smaller than the porn star. Then the one she picked, the doctor told her that she needed to sound bigger than that. It was just crazy. She's like flat, flat chested. So then it goes to Shador. Her ugly ass. Talking about she pre she thinks she pregnant. So she got two pregnancy tests for both of her friends. You know, to if, take two in case, you know, one say something different. And they could tell her what the results are. So she took the two tests and they both were positive. Then she went to this long drawn out story about how she don't want to have no baby with this dude. He got six kids, three baby mamas. And they be calling, trying to, you know, get help, calling her phone, and yada, yada, yada. So, she said, she made the decision she don't have abortion. Okay, the funny part about it, if you watch this show, when it first aired, it airs live, so the comments are wrong. That should be hilarious. That's what be making the show funny when you see the comments. I had to go back and watch it without the comments, because I be stuck in the comments. <laughs> so... She has Lynette to come take her and get her abortion. She shows up. Yeah, I can't think of the dude that be doing that hair. I can't think of his hair name right now. She showed up with him in the back seat. And she's like, um, this bitch taking me to get abortion. And I ain't told him nothing about none of my business. Why would she show up with him? Yeah, that shit was shady as fuck, though. But anyway, moving forward. Because this is going to be a quick review. So, Yvette, um, not Yvette, Lynette. She throwing a um, New Year's Eve party. The Brinks had her little album release, a record release, a review or whatever at the beginning. I left that part out. So at the party, you know, they finna turn up. She trying to open a bottle of champagne. She can't. So she do it, open it, and just throw the shit on there by the net like, really, bitch? You gonna disrespect my house? And then all the hoes in there dancing on each other, grinding on each other. And I'm thinking... Bitch, did you just have abortion? She was doing the most. She was all on the flow and shit. Bleeding everywhere. That's how you know this shit scripted. How you just had abortion and you on here all on the flow, dry fucking some girl. Just, she was doing the most. But yeah, that was pretty much the episode. I don't think them hoes did about 20, 15 minutes with all them old bootleg ass songs that they be putting in between the episodes trying to advertise like living hip hop. But, yeah. I ain't put on number some this to the eyeliner, so that's why I ain't got no eyebrows. <laughs> yeah, so don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like this video. And happy 2019. Bye.